Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Be A Pro. In Buffalo, we have the Tampa Bay Lightning round two of the year three playoffs, and this could very well be the very last performance from Tino Manny. It really depends, but yeah, we're down 3-1 in the series right now, I believe. They are absolutely dummying us. Yep. So, not looking good. Not looking good. And... What else isn't looking good is the fact that I've let in 5, 5, 4, and 3. Can't be doing that. So, yeah, my hopes are not super high. But, you know what? We've done something like this before. We've had, I think we've had a reverse sweep. So, yeah, anything's possible. This, this can happen. It's unlikely, though, because Tampa Bay is insane. Well, let's get a view of the line. So we got the first line here, which has been unreal. Reinhardt, Eichel, Olofsson, uh, Yanmark, Plekhanov, Cousins is a very good second line. And then, yeah, our depth is quite solid as well. On defense, we got the Rasmuses, Burns with Lindholm, Shea and Coughlin, and Annette, yours truly, with an X factor that I don't know if we've ever actually used or not. Not really sure, but anyway, yeah, I'm going to get sniped on by the other X-Factors. Stamkos or Kucherov are going to come in, just rip one past me like I'm not even there. Let's also check out the stats. Is Jack still going to be two points per game? I'm not really sure. He might be. Nope, not anymore. 10 games played, 18 points. 15 from Olafson, 12 from Reinhardt. We got 11 from Yanmark. Plekhanov's only put up eight. What are you doing, Plekhanov? Medium elite, 90 overall. With an X factor and five abilities? Are you kidding me? Anyway, yeah, that's how we're doing so far. I obviously am doing awful. As we, well, you don't need to see it on this screen. You can see it right here. It just displays it for the whole world. It's like, hey, look, I suck. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, we have a very, very difficult task in front of us. Let's see if we can at least push one more game. First period. Oh no, second period? Oh no, this might be it. This might just do it. If this is in fact the end of Tino Manny, then I'm probably gonna take a small break from the Be A Pro. I'm not gonna start the other one instantly. It will be back in NHL 22, don't worry about that. I will have another goalie Be A Pro in NHL 22. You don't have to, you know, think that I'm gonna wait until the next NHL, so I am Personally, guaranteeing you right now, Goalie Via Pro will come back. I just don't know when. And yeah, it's probably going to be a matter of when I run out of video ideas. <laughs> if I have nothing else to really do, or, you know, if I just am sort of feeling like doing the Goalie Via Pro again, then I'll start it back up. It's not like I'm not feeling it right now. Like, I still do love doing this, but I just feel like, you know, a quick little break, maybe... A month or two or something if I even last that long we'll see and then we'll we'll come back to it and start up a new one but yeah I'm gonna do the selecting a team because for some reason apparently NHL doesn't know how to give you the updated rosters when you start in the CHL so that's fun yeah we got to pick a team that is not gonna be an easy task but I'm definitely gonna go somewhere that needs a goalie so I'm not going to a team that, like, I'm not going to Tampa Bay that has Vasilevsky, for example. That would just be silly. So, yeah, I'm gonna try my best to... Why do you not stand up for your teammate? Are you kidding me? Wow. All right, we don't deserve to win. Kucherov gonna X-factor me. I'm trying not to budge as much as possible. And, well, there it is anyway. Was I too far out? Should I have been back in the net more? Should I have just sat there and got scored on like I did? I don't know. Well, we are down by three on the brink of elimination. I'm kind of curious to see. Like, I want to see what contract offer I get anyway and all that stuff. Like, we'll go to the offseason, see what kind of offers I get. We'll sign with the team that isn't Buffalo just to see what is going on with their team. And, yeah, that's that's about it. But I will be starting a new goalie be a pro, as I mentioned. I just don't know. Well, <laughs> that was all me. That should have been an easy save. I'm just, I don't know, man. Dino Manny's got to retire. This guy is like... Yeah, well, have you guys ever seen the movie Moneyball? Maybe. Yeah, well, if you have, Billy Bean was like a high draft pick and just didn't pan out. That's me right now, Manny. He's just going to basically quit because he can't perform in the cage. 
And, I mean, <laughs> I've had some moments that have been pretty stellar. I've had some decent performances. But Tampa Bay just knows how to absolutely bully me. And I don't know how, <laughs> how to stop it. I'm going to be real. Okay, that's a good goal. But, still down by three with 14 minutes to go. Hello, Plekhanov? That wrist shot was insane. Well, we're down by two now. That happened real quick. Okay. Well, if I hadn't let in those two goals, we'd be tied right about now. But I'm going to let in about eight more. So if you guys want to, you know, like win and stuff, then you better get on that. If we do end up mounting a comeback, this is like ice tilt at its finest. <laughs> you guys remember when that was going around? The whole ice tilt thing? I wouldn't be surprised if it was in the game, to be honest. Like, if you have played Grand Theft Auto and you do an online race, the first place car literally just starts pumping the brakes without you even actually pumping the brakes. And then the last place car all of a sudden gets nitrous and just starts speeding down everywhere. The control feels better. And yeah, I don't know why. Like, it shouldn't be like that. Just because you're in last does not mean you should get an advantage to get back up to first. That's just silly in my opinion. But anyway... It is what it is. Burns! Down low. Oh, yeah? Oh, nice try. Great save by Vazzy, though. JVR with it to middle stat. In front to Panic, who takes a shot. And Vazzy will stop that one as well. We are halfway through this third period now. Plekhanov stepping up his game big time. Maybe he will get the Hattie. I think he could do it. Pacioretty gets poked by Brent Burns. Now up to Richard. Who's going to lose it? McDonough behind the Tampa net now. Carrying it up. Oh my goodness, he dodged one hit and then got destroyed. Ah, oh, Vasilevsky with a huge poke check too. And that will get... I feel like I'm... I don't know, the mic is too close. I'm going to move that real quick. Because it just feels like the audio levels are going a lot higher than normal. Patch ready, pinned behind the net. Stamkos picks it up. But JVR will ultimately win that battle. And now he's in, over the red line, over the blue line, and he gets crushed in front of the Tampa Bay bench, and I think he's actually injured. Well, he got up and he stayed on the ice, so he can't be that bad. But, yeah, that was a pretty bad hit. Kucherov going to get hit. And now Lindholm carrying up the ice. Up to Eichel, who skates past his man. Nice try, Eichel. That was a great effort. Oh, my word. Yeah, so the boys are trying. They're definitely putting their best effort forth. Can't say the same for Manny. I just, I don't know what it is. I cannot stop any shot this team puts on net. Tampa Bay has made me feel like the smallest goaltender in the world. I just don't understand how I'm able to let in as many goals as I have. It's impressive, really. Kerfoot, coming back the other way, and now he's going to get rocked. Wrist aligning in the middle over to Paterka. All right. Haven't really seen him much. Dahlin battling on the boards against Wilson. And Wilson will emerge victorious under four minutes to go now. Two goal lead for Tampa Bay. Stamkos tried to rip one. And thankfully the defense stopped it. Otherwise it likely would have gone in. Now here comes Paterka in the middle. Oh, that was a clapper and a half. Risto back to Paterka who takes a wrist shot. Vazzy will put that one in the oven mitt. Three minutes to go. And things are... Not looking good for the Buffalo Sabres right now. Can't say the lads aren't trying, though. They are absolutely giving it their all out there. They want to at least put up a fight, you know? They don't want to go out easy-peasy, lemon-squeezy. Wow, I made a save. It's a miracle. Should make a movie about it. All right, Paterka, dumping the puck in. Two minutes to go. I'm probably going to get pulled soon, but I haven't been yet. Kerfoot over the line. Is he going to snipe me again? He's going to... Like, why? What was that movement? I don't understand. Olofsson with it over the red line. And here I go. Actually, someone was saying... What, hold on a second. All right, so now that I'm on the bench, it should still... Nope, it's not going to do it. Okay, well, that's awesome. Not like I just changed that or anything. There's bench camera, and I just changed it to overhead, and it did not do anything. No, I will not accept this. One moment. Is this not it? Bench camera set to overhead? Like, what? what's classic? I don't know. What do I normally play on? Is there, like, a regular camera? I guess it's just high and high because of the goalie thing, but 
Yeah, like, why Why is this not working? <laughs> I'm so confused. Is this not the right one? It says bench camera. And this says penalty box camera. I just set them both to overhead. Let's see if it makes a difference. Or if I'm still... All right, awesome. And are they going to get an empty netter? No, they're not. Eichel going to step up and stop that. Olafsson gets drilled a lot. Oh my word, he's got to be hurt. But we got a power play. That's not going to do us a whole lot right now. I think we're pretty much done. Is that actually like that, by the way, at the Amelie Arena? Like, there's just seats right in between the benches like that? That seems pretty weird. But I guess. I mean, yeah, I don't know. Will Sorelli get the empty net? No, he's gonna fire that very wide. That was not even close. You gotta think, was he really trying? Or was the ice just tilted? Ha <laughs> ha! Joking. Sorelli. Over the line, and he's going to narrowly miss. Yanmark picks it up off the boards. Five seconds to go. And that is going to do it for Tino Manny's pathetic little career. <laughs> Just so belittling. Oh, but yeah, there you go. Congrats, Tampa. You officially own us. We suck. Now that silly little reporter is going to think I owe him the time of day, and he's going to be like, oh, what happened? You're supposed to only let in one goal and win. Shut up, buddy. <laughs> I've had enough. Actually, I just watched... Well, this is going to be super old by the time this comes out. But at the end of the interviews, uh, I guess Connor McDavid wanted to speak with Mark Spector. So I, I guess he thought they were off the air. And he's like, hey, Spec, can I talk to you for a second? Pretty, uh, pretty intense stuff. But yeah. Why are you smiling, bro? Not only do you suck, but your career is also over. All right, well, let's sim to the next big event. And I'll stop, I suppose, when... We find out who wins the Stanley Cup. It's probably going to be Tampa. I also just now realized that I never pressed record on my camera. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Why? Why? Well, I might as well turn all these lights off then. That is... Oh, what a way to go out. What a way to go out. That is just basically... The It just encompasses this series. What a stinker. Well, here's the draft lottery results. Uh, thank you very much. Don't care. Um, yeah, so... Oh, let's go to Toronto, baby. Absolutely. Yup, we're going home. Sim to next season. Oh, wait, no, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> oh, man, I can't even talk anymore. This is just a dumpster fire. Stat Central. Let's check out the awards and see who won what. So, the... Vancouver Canucks are Stanley Cup champions. Golden Knights with the Presidents. And there you go. Tampa did make it to the finals. Connor McDavid with the Art Ross. Svech gets the Hart. Pi Trangelo with the Norris. Lady Bing goes to Tara Vinen. Shane Wright with the Calder. boy. Hoaglander with the Con Smythe. Grubauer gets the Vesna and the William M. Jennings. Ferentz with the Bill Masterton. Matthews gets the Selkie. The Ted Lindsay goes to Svech. And the Rocky Richard. Wow, Matthews has been dominating in the goals department in this. Well, it would have been nice to play with you, but not going to happen. Tino Manny's got to go. He's not it. We actually finished with exactly a 900 save percentage. I don't know if I ever acknowledged that or not. I probably did, but did not remember. We're 87, and we are in a Leafs uniform. That is weird looking. Anyway, let's just view the lines to see what could have been. Brady Kachuk, Matthews at 96 overall. And then we have Marner as well. Yep. Silverberg, Schmaltz, and Perron. This is a good team. Tavares has really tailed off. Cody Glass. On the fourth line? Are you kidding me? Sonny Milano. All right. Uh, that's not even the right Nylander. Where's the other one? Oh, well. Defense. Sandine and Latang. This... Uh, now we... Brent Burns followed us. Get out of here. I don't want anyone if I was on that team. Absolutely not. Goalies, we got Manny and Mrazic. Okay, well, we're not actually going to play, but this could have been a thing. And, yeah, that is that is very unfortunate. I, Oh, man. If only the series could have gone a little bit better. Well, anyways, I hope you guys at least enjoyed it. Got some enjoyment out of it, because that is obviously the primary goal. Whether we do well or not. As long as you're entertained and having a good time watching it, then that is the primary target here. So, yeah, I don't know how much we have $1 million to spend, but we're not going to spend it because 
Tino Manny is a dumpster fire and doesn't deserve anything. <laughs> Skill tree, we're not going to spend that point. Uh, what about record book? I, well, probably can't see a whole lot in here. Not really. No. NHL. So, Flower with 1,904 games played. Is that good? Joe Thornton. Wow. 1,920 points. at a boy. Most goals, Wayne Gretzky. Ovechkin's going to pass you, 100%. Um, and he won't pass you for points. I'll tell you that for free. I don't think anyone's ever going to pass him for points. But, yeah, there you go. 125 shutouts. That is mental. All right, well, anyways. Yeah, like I said, guys, I hope that you at least got some joy from this series, had fun watching it, even though the performance in it was lackluster to say the minimum you know that's actually being polite <laughs> but yeah we had we had our ups we had our downs lots of downs a couple ups here and there few and far between but as long as we all had a good time that is all that matters so thank you guys so much for watching this series i will be starting up a new goalie be a pro i'm not exactly sure when but i will be starting it all right, so you have my word on that. And just, yeah, if you guys could subscribe, that'd be sick. I do release other videos, believe it or not. Um, probably more than Be A Pro, actually, at least recently. But I did a Be A Pro week, and that is the current week as of when I'm recording this. So, yeah, thank you, guys. I'll see you soon.